Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing an American hair care products versus Filipino hair care products. Now if you guys are familiar, if you're in the beauty community, there's this video going on with American makeup versus um, Korean makeup. And I wanted to do kind of like the same, but however in the hair care department. So let's start first with the American hair care. I'm gonna be telling you all exactly what I'm going to be using. All right, so for my shampoo and conditioner, I'm going to be using the main and tail shampoo and conditioner and then for the hair mask I will be using the Wella Professionals Brilliance all right so after that I will be using HSI leave-in arrogant oil and then lastly just to top it all off I'm going to be using the mane and tail shine on maximum high gloss finish and it looks like this all right so for the Filipino hair care products I will be using our very own Moringa O Malungai herbal shampoo and then I'm also going to be using the Malungai Herbal Conditioner. It looks like this. All right, so now for the hair mask, I will be using the Hair Fix Hair Treatment Intense Straight. It's coconut milk and silk proteins. All right, so for the serum, I'm going to be using Vitress Cuticle Coat Instant Relax. And also to top it all off, I'm also going to be using the Hair Fix Silky Soft Shine perfume hair mist. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, you guys, so in this side of my hair, I'm going to be using American products, and in this, it's going to be all Filipino products. I'm going to be using the mane and tail, and actually, I've used the shampoo before. Hmm, smells good. So, you all may know, when I put the shampoo, I always just put it and use it on the top part of my head, just basically on my scalp. And I'm also using this on my third day hair to just really test and see how good the shampoos can clean my hair. Other side, right here, I'm going to be using the Malungai. It looks like this. It's green. I do like both of the smells. The has actually has kind of like a sweet-ish scent to it, which is nice. The Filipino side, I will be using the Hair Fix. For 69 pesos, this is a lot. So I'm going to put that all over my hair right here. Especially down to the very tips. On the other side, I will be using the Wella Brilliance Treatment. Okay. I'm going to leave on both of these hair masks on my hair for 5 minutes. And then I'm going to wash it off. And then I'm going to be using the conditioner after. I'll be using the mane and tail conditioner. It looks like this. Alright, so now that's done, I'm gonna let that stay on my hair for another two minutes and then wash it off. Alright, so I'm done washing. I'm just gonna dry out my hair. Alright, you guys, so I just air dried my hair and now this is what it looks like. This is on the side where I use American products and this is the side where I use the Filipino um, products. So, we're not yet done, we're still going to be putting some leave-on oils and some hair shine products. And then after that, I'm gonna give you all my full thoughts about all of the products. So, right, so on this side, I will be using this product from HSI. It smells really good. I'm just gonna get a tiny bit, just a little bit, just like that. And then I'm gonna rub that with my hands and just put that on the bottom part of my hair, especially on my ends. I do like the smell of this as well because it actually has a nice lingering smell to it. I like putting just the excess of it on like the top part right here just to tame down any like... You know how like those baby hairs, like those newly grown baby hairs, sometimes they're annoying, they kind of stick out so sometimes I just like to tame, tame them down a little bit. My bangs are already there. <laughs> Alright, so that's what it looks like right now and in here at this side, I'm going to be using our very own Vitress. And actually, when I bought this, I didn't check. I just looked at it. But when I opened it, it was like the pump thingy was gone. So, so I was like, you know what? I'm just going to open it like this. And I'm just going to use the product just like that. Now, the thing that I really do like about Vitress is that, of course, it smells really good. However, don't put a lot because sometimes it can really weigh down your hair. It can make your hair look like it's greasy if you add in a lot. Alright, so for the last and final touches, on this side I will be using the Mane and Tail Shine On um, High Gloss Finish and this is oil and alcohol free. Go ahead and spray this all over my hair. 
I think I've used this in the past, but I just forgot how actually this smells really good. Now on the other side, I will be using the Hair Fix Silky Soft Shine Perfume Hair Mist. So what I'll do is I'll just spray it. With this thing though, it kind of feels like my hair was just wet with water. It's not as moisturizing. Here is the finished result. I don't know if you guys can see or even tell any difference. I think both of them kind of look the same, but I feel like I can tell the difference on how my hair feels right now. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and reevaluate everything. Now starting with the shampoo, I both, actually both like the Mane and Tail and the Moringa on my hair as shampoos because they both did a really good job in cleaning my scalp. Alright, so with the hair mask, I think I would pick the Wella just because when I was putting it um, on my hair and when I was washing it off, my hair felt really butter soft. The hair fix was also good. It was actually good for its price. So Wella is a bit pricey, but the quality is good. If you are looking for an affordable hair mask, you can buy locally, you can go for hair fix. But however, if you are looking for a good product, especially if your hair is dyed or if your hair is dry, the Wella hair mask is really good for you. All right, so with the conditioner, I actually do like both of the conditioners. I do like the smell of the Moringa, just because the smell of the mane and tail conditioner is it's somewhat okay. It doesn't have um, a really strong fruity fragrance, which is the thing that I really like. Is but however, their effectiveness and their ability to condition your hair is definitely on point. All right, so for the leave-in oil serum, I actually like both of them. I do like the Vitress and I do like the HSI. I think that they both did a really good job. But however, I feel like if I'm going to treat my ends, I would go for HSI just because it really does moisturizes your ends for. A a really long time without me having to apply throughout the day but however if I ever ran out of my HSI the Vitress one is a good substitute and lastly the finishing touches I actually like the mane and tail shine on because it does not contain any oil I'm rest assured that this one I think it would be way much better for your hair because it doesn't contain alcohol so it doesn't have any tendency to dry out your hair and for some reason it's not really oily, but it does make your hair feel very soft and smooth without weighing it down or without making it look like it's oily. With the hair fix, the hair fix is also good, but I find that when you put that on your hair, it does give a scent to your hair. And I think, yeah, it does give a little bit of soft and shine to your hair, but I'm concerned because it says that it's perfume. So I'm not so sure if this contains alcohol. So that's just it. I do like the effect of all all of the hair care products on my hair right now. Um, actually, it's hard to pick which hair care routine would work best for me because I, I do like both. But however, which one did you guys like? I think the effectiveness of it is kind of like the same. So yeah, I think this gives you all the variation. If you are from the Philippines, you can definitely follow this hair care routine or you consider checking out the products that I use on the Filipino hair care. And, and if you're in the US, you can do the same and try out some of the Mane and Tail, try out some of HSI's uh, hair care product and Wella because they're really great brands as well. So that is it you guys, let me know in the comments down below if you want more videos like this because next time I'm actually going to be trying German hair care products like salon hair care products versus China's salon hair care products and I'm gonna try that on my sister's hair just because those products are really meant for um, hair that's dyed so I think my sister's hair would be a great example for that so that you can all hear her experience and also let me know in the comments down below what more hair care products you would all want me to try out so that is it you guys I hope you all like this video and if you did please give this video a thumbs up and I will see you in the next one bye